Hello everybody and welcome back to Squidoodle's Sky Grid series and it's a beautiful day and a tree. Oh, another big tree. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Yay. We now have two big trees on the island doggies. Hello Fido. Hello Shun. How are you today? Have your morning melon. There you go. A beautiful melon for you, beautiful doggies. Uh, hello, welcome, guys. Uh, if you missed last episode, we'd... Whoa, another big tree. That's a small tree. It's not that big. It's kind of small. We'll have it. We're going to need it for today. Uh, but yeah, last episode, what we did is we made our fantastic brewing room, and it's lovely. We need to make some windows for it. We also started to work on the treehouse, and I basically uh, left it up to you guys today in the comments section. Uh, last episode, I don't know why I said today, last episode I basically uh, said to you guys, what do you want to do with it? What should we do with it? Uh, and a lot of you guys said uh, that you want it to become an actual place for my dogs. Now, uh, I've been giving it some thought and it could work, but um, the dogs might fall, okay? So, if we do have the doggies in there, then they're gonna have to like have some kind of water to jump into uh, because dogs don't uh, dogs take fall damage cats don't dogs do uh, So these guys might take fall damage if we have them in the treehouse uh, But I do like the idea. I think it's uh, an amazing idea. We're gonna work on it soon uh, But we need to get a couple of things sorted um, For today and uh, what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be making a mob spawn and now uh, what I've been doing in between episodes uh, just to save you guys from the time lapses is Basically mining uh, a lot of cobblestone also uh, a couple of trees have grown and we have a little bit of wood uh, Since we got that big tree I can make uh, some re I could probably mine that and get quite a lot of planks out of it uh, So yeah, basically we're gonna make a giant mob spawner because as you guys know uh, We're trying to get our island back and we need mobs for XP so I can enchant stuff. What's up with my dogs? Can you be quiet? I'm trying to speak please come on let 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 daddy speak. I'm going to come over here so they don't, so they don't shout over everyone. But yeah, uh, we need to make a mob spawner uh, somewhere on this island. So I need to try and find a way of where to put it. Uh, maybe over this way, maybe over this way. It doesn't really matter, uh, but we're going to make one. We've got uh, about five stacks of cobble. We have a couple of stacks of wood. Uh, it's not going to be that big, but hopefully we can get it done. So let's just... Uh, we're just gonna give it a go. So yeah, uh, let's do this. So the first thing that we're gonna need uh, for the mob spawner is obviously uh, blocks. So we're gonna get started with cobble. Eh? I don't know why I put it just back there. Uh, but what we do need to do is we also need to mine this big tree here. So I'm gonna have to quickly just uh, block up a small perimeter around this tree uh, just so I don't lose the uh, the wood. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna quickly do this. We're gonna chop the tree down. We should gain the blocks back from what we're using on this cobblestone. A uh, little path. Uh, and then we're basically going to make like a simple mob spawner. We're hopefully going to get it done this episode. I'm going to try my best. Uh, it's going to be a really simple design. The simplest uh, design I can think of. Uh, which is kind of like a big tower. And it's like a two by two hole. And that goes all the way up to the top. There's kind of like water uh, in the top that pu pushes all the mobs down to the bottom. And I think the mobs basically die of fall damage. Or... Uh, they basically... Was that it for the tree? Surely that just wasn't it for the tree. Because it looked massive. Was it just full of leaves? Surely not. I only got like, oh, there's a couple of pieces of wood here, but we should have got more than that. Right, let's just mine this. I am... I do know I'm walking on leaves here, and this is quite dangerous, because leaves are falling underneath me. Oh! Right, there's a piece of coal there, so we're going to quickly grab that. But look at this tree. We thought it was quite a big one, but it's not. It contains hardly anything. I think we get more from uh, from one of them small trees. Oh, well. This has got a piece of coal out of it. Let's mine our way down, uh, and we'll get cracking uh, on this mob spawner. Uh, now, I'm looking forward to this because, obviously, uh, with mob spawners, we get skeletons. Uh, so that means we get bone meal. We can obviously get uh, bow and arrows, and it's going to be amazing. So, uh, let's get started. Let's start building it. We'll start building it this way. Uh, over here, so let's get cracking on here. So all we need to do is we're gonna make this really simple uh, We're gonna make it a two by two area like so and then we're basically gonna have to mine up from this So this is gonna be just a big tunnel going all the way up and there's gonna be a huge mob thing there Now we might I'm, I'm hoping we get it done. I'm just gonna get cracking So we're gonna put a couple of blocks here to start off now, we also need a block there I'm gonna just leave that there because we need to go up on the bits uh, on the sides. We don't need to go up on the corners or anything like that. So if we just go up on these bits, uh, like so. Uh, also, 
Uh, we're going to need somewhere to jump into because, uh, as you know, we're going to go quite high. It's going to be quite a big drop. So we're going to actually maybe take myself a bucket or something like that because uh, I don't want to die. So we need a bucket. Did What did we do with the bucket? The bucket, oh, it was... Oh, we use it, didn't we, for this? Oh, no, do we have any left? Do we have any uh, other iron? We've got two iron ore, but I don't think that is enough. Do we have any iron uh, just floating around? <laughs> floating, do you get it? Because everything's ah, wasted. These jokes are wasted on you guys. Uh, <laughs> there's a spider just chilling up there. I'm going to quickly just go and grab this piece of iron. Hopefully, I can get it without losing everything. Probably, I will just lose everything, knowing me. Oh, oh. All right, there we go. Um, so, get out of the way, sugarcane. We're crouching. We can get this piece of iron. Oh, there we go, like a boss. Grab this piece, and let's go back to the island. Just quickly smell up a bucket, and then we can get started. Uh, because I don't want to go up there and not have a way to get down or up. Otherwise, I'll just kill myself. And I do have uh, some levels uh, that I want to keep, so I'm going to keep hold of them. This will only take just a minute, and while we're doing that... Is there any other trees grown? We're going to turn all this wood uh, into stuff. How many have we got? How many have we got? We've got, we got nearly two stacks of wood. That is pretty good. So that's like five stacks of cobble, two stacks of wood. We should be able to get quite a bit done, hopefully. And 16 pieces of stone. It's going to be a very ugly mob spawner, but it doesn't matter because it, it's going to work. So, yeah. There we go. Three pieces of iron done straight away. We're going to quickly grab ourselves a bucket. And then we are going to head... Uh, to that water source over there. Where is my bucket gone? There they are. There is my bucket. Uh, and then we're gonna start nerd pulling. I'm not really sure how tall it needs to be, so we're just gonna um, we're just gonna guess it to be honest. So let's grab this and jump back. There's Daisy down there. We still need to get Daisy on the island. That's gonna be next uh, on my agenda. But let's go. Let's do this. So we need to go up here like this. We're just gonna. I don't know how how much we need to go up. Let's just go up. Let's use about two stacks on this bit. Uh, because we're going to need uh, the, the top of it. The, the top of it is going to be quite big. Basically, uh, I've actually built it before. I think I did it uh, in one of the first ever videos I created with Stampy. Uh, we had like a mob spawner competition. It was who could make uh, like a, a cool looking mob spawner. Uh, and this is going to be the exact same design actually. Uh, which is pretty cool. Uh, and all it is is a big funnel like this. And at the top... Uh, oh, a piece of wood. Uh, there's, not, there's not a piece of wood at the top. There is here. But uh, at the top... There is basically uh, like four pieces of water and a big open room. And what what happens is the mobs spawn in the big open room and they walk towards the water. The water then pushes the mobs down and I'm going to put some signs at the top of the funnel and they'll just fall down and they'll take fall damage. And hopefully uh, the fall damage will be enough uh, just for just me to basically like hit them once or twice and get all the loot. Uh, if not, then basically... Uh, it just becomes the one that used to be on my Skyland, which is basically they just kill themselves and drop loot, but they don't actually drop XP. So uh, this one needs to be kind of high, high enough for them to take fall damage, but not like kill them. So I think if I go two more up, this might just be actually perfect. I think we've done this uh, absolutely perfecto. Uh, so let's just carry on. Uh, doing this like so and then we can get cracking. We're gonna grab these pieces of wood It's actually really good because we're gonna need these all uh, all for the top Is there any other stuff above? There's another piece of wood there. There's some coal here It's actually quite a good way uh, of getting all the materials just like mining all the way up So let's grab all these and then what we do here. I believe if I'm <laughs> I mean, I, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I haven't done this in ages. So if I get this wrong uh, My apologies, um, <laughs> so we'll just see how it goes. So let's crouch we're going to start building uh, along here. We're going to go, I believe... Oh, no, I should know this. How, how, how... how oh, what? <laughs> I can't remember what it is. It's got to be something the water travels. Is it 12 blocks? I think it's 12. One, two, three... Oh, I'm going to get this wrong. I, I bet you guys are shouting. I'm like, it's only 10. I hope it's 12. One, two, three, four. Okay, let's do this. Five, six, seven, eight. I think... Is it eight? Is it, is it eight or... Is it 8 or 12? Okay, let's just do this, right? Let's just let's just do a quick tester. Okay, so I'm going to put some... Am I still... I'm, I'm, I'm still crouching. It's okay. So we're going to just build these sides along here. And then I'm just going to do a quick tester. Uh, because if I get this wrong, uh, then I could have just wasted like a load of cobblestone. So I'm going to do this now. And hopefully, uh, this is perfect. Uh, if you're wondering what I'm doing, I'm probably not making much sense. All I'm wanting to know... Is um, water supposed to stop flowing uh, after a certain amount of blocks? So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So let's just have a look at this. Put this water there, and 
Yeah, it's eight. Woo, we did it. Eight blocks. Look at this. So this is the first tunnel done. Uh, so basically, uh, the mobs will spawn on a platform here. They'll walk to this thing, and they'll just get pushed into it. Uh, so we basically just do the same thing uh, all along the other sides. Now, what I should do is I should probably sleep because it's getting quite dark. Uh, hopefully, my gamma uh, is turned all the way up because sometimes uh, it has a tendency to not do it. Oh, we, we're fine. We're fine. We're cool. Uh, so let's just carry on building. We can build through the night, and hopefully we can get this finished. So... Uh, that's one, two, three, and we're just going to basically carry this along uh, for all the sides. So, uh, what I'm going to do, uh, as I'm not actually going to be m mining any for time lapses, if I'm not going to be mining any cobblestone doing any time lapses today, uh, since you've seen me do the first bit, uh, what I'll do is I'll just do a quick little time lapse of me basically finishing these four sides. So, let's do this. Right, we've done it. Basically, that is uh, the mob spawning. We're going to eat some melon because I am very, very hungry. And, uh, yeah, all there is to do now is make this platform square. And uh, I need to fill the rest of my water, which I should quickly do now. I kind of should build myself uh, an unlimited water source because I don't actually have one, uh, which is kind of silly. I think I should be able to make it from the water I've got in the melon farm and the water over there. Uh, so I'm going to quickly jump down and I'm going to do that now. I'm going to grab myself. Actually, I could just do it up here, couldn't I? If I've got, I've got two, yeah, I can do, I can do it up here. I should be able to do it up here. So if I just quickly, what's this? Is this sand? If this is sand, yeah, it's sand. Okay, so if I just make a quick square. Uh, joining up with that, and then we're all good to go. So I'll just quickly just make this over here. Uh, I need to. F oh, a flower! Oh, a flower, flower, flower! Right, I'm gonna grab this quickly. There we go. Let's crouch. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna make a big square over there, join it all up, and then we're gonna make it three high uh, so that every type of mob should be able to actually uh, spawn up in here, and then. Put a roof on it, and it should uh, be pretty much finished. Hopefully, I've got enough materials uh, to finish this thing. I think I should just uh, have enough with the wood. I've still got the wood left, and I'm collecting more along the way, uh, as well as other materials. Uh, so, let's get cracking. Let's do this uh, really quickly. I will uh, fill it all in again. Uh, I'm going to make myself a quick little uh, little thing here. So, if I just block this off like there, uh, then we can make a... An unlimited water source there. So if I grab one piece here, uh, pull it over to this side, put it in. Oh no, 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 wrong side. There we go. Put it in that side. Uh, run over here, do the exact same thing. Uh, grab it there, and then we should be good to go. And that should just be uh, enough for our water source. There we go. We can just keep grabbing it, and it should be perfect. Uh, we've got to be careful not to fall in the big hole. Oh, this water's going to be pushing me though. Uh, we're going to grab another piece, and uh, yeah. So we need a name for this. It's going to be Squidoolay's Spectacular Spider Spawner, as well as other. Uh, other mobs spawn in it, hopefully. Uh, I'm not sure if Endermen are actually going to spawn in this. Uh, they probably won't. Um, they're probably going to be uh, a big pain, and we're going to have to just, like, build just a big platform just, like, somewhere out in the open uh, just for Endermen to spawn in because they're going to be really awkward. Uh, I was actually just going to go to sleep quickly, but it is just coming nighttime, so I think we're we're pretty much good to go. So, that's the four si uh, three sides done. That one's containing the water. Uh, so, what all I need to do now is what I'm going to uh, do one of the quick little time lapse for because it's quite a uh, it's quite boring. Um, so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna quickly do a time lapse for this bit and uh, we're gonna fill in all the rest of it. So let's go. My legs are broken. Wow, look how much we've done. That is crazy. Uh, 
we're just doing all right. We kind of run out a bit of materials halfway through. Uh, but the mob spawner is coming together. We need to plant some more trees uh, because we are running out. And there's just a creeper there. What are you doing, creeper? You're going to be falling through this little mob spawner soon. So just have a bit of patience, all right? Uh, okay, so... What do we do now then? Well, we need some more materials. So, you know what this means, guys. We're going to try and do this bob spawner in this episode, and I promised uh, we'd try and get it done. Uh, so, we're going to go absolutely crazy now. We're going to basically uh, plant some trees everywhere. We need loads of wood. We need loads of cobblestone. We're going to see how much mud we've actually got in here. We've got 12 pieces of mud. We've got uh, a lot more saplings, but we're going to make ourselves uh, a little tree farm. So... We're going to do this. We're going to put loads of saplings on here. Hopefully, uh, this is going to grow. Also, what we're going to do now is we're going to quickly just grab ourselves uh, a stone pickaxe. Hopefully, we got enough. Let's just do this. We'll, we'll place ourselves at uh, the stone down. Where? Can I hear a zombie? Where's it? I can hear a zombie. Where? Can you hear a zombie? Where's it? Where's it? Where's the zombie? Can you hear a zombie or is it just me? Hello? Zombie? Zombie? Where's it? Is he underneath my island? It's just... I think he's... I think he... I think he is. I think he's literally underneath my island. Hello? Z zombie? Stop tr He's there! I can see... I can see your legs, zombie! I can see your legs! They're all spawning below my island. <laughs> oh, dearie me. Anyway, what was I saying before that zombie rudely interrupted me? We also need some more cobbler wobbly just to finish off this design. So I'm going to quickly just go and mine some out of here really quickly. We need to make ourselves uh, another pickaxe. We've also got ourselves some more wood in here. I want to get this done. I want to make some progress and we're going to get this done. Come on, let's try uh, and get as much cobblestone. Uh, as we possibly can. Hopefully, I think if we get like one more stack of it, it should pretty much be okay. Uh, also, if it if they wouldn't stop burning, it'd be okay. Uh, yeah. Also, what we need to do is we need them trees to grow really fast. We could do with actually making like a proper tree farm, uh, which would be pretty awesome. Uh, so yeah, let's try and get ourselves uh, a little bit more materials, and then hopefully uh, we can end up with some kind of finished product. Whew. Right, guys, I've been working up a sweat. I am sweating. I'm a sweaty squid. I've, I've been I've been working hard, and uh, I've got quite a lot more materials. I've got a couple of stacks of wood, uh, but three stacks of stone. We should be able to finish it, hopefully. If not, get somewhere close, but I'm happy uh, with the progress that we've made today. I'm, I'm very happy. So, uh, we need to get back up there, which is probably going to waste... Uh, some more materials. I wish I had some like jumpy pads or something like that. That'd be quite cool just to get there. Or a jetpack or something like that. Um, but that's not possible. So we're going to have to uh, probably just, just walk up like a regular a regular human being. So let's get up here. Let's try and mine through this. And uh, and then we can just nerd pull all the way up to the top. Hopefully uh, we don't waste that much material. We, we're going to just use this stone actually. Let's just get up here. Let's just... Uh, use these little bits of stone uh, that we've acquired through smelting and there we go We don't have to waste any other cobblestone So uh, what we have to do now is we basically just have to fill in uh, the rest of this stuff. Hello, mr. Spider um, In the middle of the night because I've slept since the last saw you um, I had to move my bed because there was that pesky zombie uh, that was right underneath my house uh, And basically it wouldn't let me sleep because he's moved in to my island. What a guy. So we're going to have to hopefully uh, take care of him. We need a bow and arrow to try and take care of that guy. Uh, to try and get him off the the blocks below us. Hopefully uh, the mobs, like, I don't know, they start spawning in this from now on. Instead of spawning, like, below my island and on other blocks. Uh, hopefully they do that. Uh, that'd be that'd be very good instead of spawning below. Uh, so I can't see them or attack them. Uh, but look at this, we nearly got it done, we pretty much nearly got this done, we got the sides to build, uh, which is probably going to take uh, quite a while, but that doesn't mean uh, that we haven't made some crazy progress today, we've been building uh, non-stop, I've been building pretty much non-stop for about uh, 45 minutes now, uh, trying to do this, but saying that, uh, it's all legit. It's all super legit, we've been mining with our cobblestone generator, we've been planting trees, and you know what? It feels good. It feels good to, to do this just off 
a cobblestone generator and a bunch of trees. It feels like I've achieved something. It feels it feels good. It does feel really good. Uh, so we've got like a little bit more wood left. We're probably going to have to use a bit of stone in this, but it doesn't matter. We've kept uh, up to the pattern uh, pretty much up till now, and uh, it doesn't matter. We can use a bit of cobblestone. I think the walls... Uh, are pretty much going to take quite a lot uh, to try and uh, mine up to build up because they're going to take three uh, in height and uh, we're going to have to put a roof on it as well uh, because it needs to be super dark for the mobs to actually spawn in there. So, uh, yeah, basically, uh, that's going to take quite a lot of... Uh, co have we got enough? I think we've just got enough just to finish this. Boom, look at that. We've basically uh, finished it now. We've finished the side. We haven't finished the whole thing, but we've finished uh, the actual base and it's looking uh, pretty darn epic. So... Uh, all there is to do now, I'll just quickly show you guys because we're running out of time, but I'll probably get this done in between episodes. Uh, we need to build all the way around the sides uh, free high, uh, like so. So this needs to go uh, all the way around, uh, and this needs to be free high uh, so that zombies and skeletons and maybe even possibly endermen uh, can fit up here. I don't think endermen will actually spawn uh, up here, but they might do, they might do. Uh, I think they take fall damage, but they hate water, I think, Enderman, so I don't think they'll have... Uh, I don't think they want to actually, like, jump into the centre. Uh, so, yeah, we should be pretty much good to go after this. We should uh, be pretty awesome. And actually, uh, saying that, I've nearly just finished the side, just walking around and doing this. Uh, as I say, it does need to be uh, free high, uh, but I only think, like, a couple more stacks of cobblestone should do it. I think the roof is going to take about four stacks. Uh, to do, judging by what, how much it actually took to do uh, the uh, the wooden columns, the wooden uh, sort of bits on there. Uh, but absolutely awesome. We've made some super progress today. Uh, we've basically uh, nearly finished it. Whoa, there's a there's a there's a water block there. Uh, but yeah, it's done. It's pretty much done this. This is awesome. Woo, we've done it. Woo, we did it. Uh, see, we just mine these two now. Uh, this will basically let the water flow uh, all the way to this edge. And then all the... Well, 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 what, what's happening here? Is this one shot? Have we done this Have we done this wrong? Let's just have a think about this. Let's let's block this up here. Uh, what's, what's happening here? All the, oh, I see what's happened here. There we go. There was a water source block actually uh, one shot. So the water was tippling over. Uh, and I've just got rid of it. But it doesn't even matter. <laughs> this should float to the edge now. Is it going to float? There we go. So that's perfect. Absolutely perfect. That mob spawner uh, is complete. Uh, next episode, uh, it'll be pretty much finished. I'm going to do it outside just because we spent like all this episode getting it done. Uh, but some good progress, guys. Hopefully, uh, by next episode, we should have uh, a load of mobs uh, spawning down here, just getting themselves killed. Uh, I can just finish them off with my sword and be like, yeah, get back, get back. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so, yeah, it should be pretty much epic. So... Uh, hopefully I've enjoyed today's episode. We've done a lot of building. There's been a lot of time lapse, but we've made a lot of progress. Uh, I'd like to thank you uh, so much for watching, guys. Uh, my name has been Skidoodle, and hope you join me in the next episode for some more Skygrid. So, I'll see you later. Bye!